please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the moment of silence. Teachers, please check for your dress code compliance. Good morning, PCHS, and welcome back to Barrison News. I'm Brianna James, and today is Tuesday, September 12, 2023. Homecoming ticket sales will continue at all three lunches today. The homecoming dance is this Friday night at PCHS after the football game. In order to attend, you must meet the following requirements, must be on track to graduate on time, no more than three unexcused absences in any class, no outstanding debt, less than $15 charged in the lunchroom, no serious discipline incidents this year. Any guests who are not PCHS students are to be approved by PCHS administration last week. The date for letter jacket orders, which were originally scheduled for this week, will now take place on Wednesday, September 20th, after school from 3.30 until 7 p.m. PCHS is hosting a blood drive on September 26th. Sign up during your lunch beginning on Tuesday. You must be 16 years old to donate. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Nolan. Now here's Corbin with sports. PCHS Volleyball travels to Long County today. JV plays at 5 and Varsity at 6. If you can't make it to the game, you can watch those matches on the NFHS Network. Little Bears Softball is at home this evening at 6. Please come out and support the team if you can, but if you can't, that game will also be broadcast on the NFHS Network. PCHS Football is back at home this Friday against Charlton County for homecoming. And at the end of today's news, stick around for a special cross-country update. And now Zeke with a look at weather. Here's what's looking at the weather. Today there will be a high of 89 and a low of 71 with a 15% chance of rain. Tonight's sunset will be at 7.40 p.m. and tomorrow's sunrise will be at 7.11 a.m. Here's what's cooking in Bear's Cafe. In a blue line, cheesy barbecue mash with garlic bread and a fresh express lime, ham and turkey subs. In a cooking chicken line, chicken chunks with rolls. In a pizza line, cheese and pepperoni pizza. For breakfast tomorrow, I mean today, no, tomorrow, waffle bars. And here's Natalie with birthdays. Happy birthday today to Grace Leslie, Grace Leslie, Moody Jeffrey, Brayden McKendry, Zariah Megali, Gabrielle McKinney, Jackson Smith, Olivia Bennett, and Ellie K. Bennett. Today's quote of the day, you will always have two choices, your commitment and your fear. The PBIS word of this month is commitment. Always be responsible, respectful, and safe. Thanks and go Bears. My name is Sophie Scruggs. Being on homecoming court is an honor to me because I was voted by my fellow classmates. It is such a privilege to represent my class, my school, and this wonderful community. Being a Pierce County Bear means showing pride in who we are. It is the hard work each bear contributes on the practice field and in class, the entire community supporting and celebrating who we are. My name is Braylon Bayrock. Being on homecoming court is an honor because I get to represent my senior class. Being a Pierce County Bear means that I'm a part of a school system that prepares students for success by upholding high academic standards and providing an atmosphere of school spirit with athletic programs with a student body that is eager to show support and love for our hometown. My name is Adeline Tuttle. Um, it's an honor to be on the homecoming court because my peers chose me as one of the girls to represent our senior class. Um, it's also an honor because homecoming is a tradition and it's just a good environment to be a part of and so I'm glad that I get to be a part of it. What it means to be a Pierce County Bear uh, 
is that excellence is the standard and that with that being the standard, it's setting a foundation for me to succeed. My name is Esmeralda Santana. Being on homecoming court is an honor because it's an opportunity to represent myself, my school, and my character. Being a Pierce County Bear means being friendly, spirited, and waking up every single morning to come to our beautiful high school with Coach Jernigan guarding the Golden Gates of Pierce County High. Go Bears! And have you bought your parking pass yet? <laughs>